Hi, and welcome to today's Arch Capital Update. Now, first of all, uh, a big thank you. Um, we've received a lot of um, introductions and referrals over the last few months, uh, mainly from, from you, from our clients. So we really appreciate that. Um, we're in a world of uh, a lot of change. Uh, last year particularly was a challenging year, and um, we're glad if, for all of you and, and anyone you know, if we're able to provide that honest, independent advice, um, then that's what we're here to do. So thanks, thanks very much. Um, we also have an offer um, which we have broadcast in the past, but just want to remind you for all families, so children or direct family, even, even close friends, um, we always offer a complimentary uh, advice uh, service. We'll have one or two meetings if we can, if we can help them out. So um, just a reminder that we're, we're here to help uh, family as well. Um, today I want to talk a few, about a few things, particularly a little bit about the market volatility. So what we're starting to see is a bit of a shift. And there's always a warning when you come into a new year and everyone's overconfident. Um, the Reserve Bank says interest rates aren't going to change for three years. And within a few weeks, what do we see? We see the reverse happening. That's what markets do. And that's why we invest the way we do. We're so diversified. We don't try to predict the future. We stay well balanced. So let's have a look. Here's the NASDAQ. Here it is, this huge run up, everyone's getting onto tech stocks, everyone's online making money, it's easy. Well, no, it's not. Suddenly it's dropped. Now you're gonna get all these Facebookers and TikTokers thinking, what's happened? This isn't so easy. So markets do this all the time. It's always a bit unexpected. So we're gonna see a bit of this now. Um, the valuations of these big tech companies has been high. Um, and you've had all these sort of day traders getting excited. That's always a bit of a warning sign. And you know, of course, we'd never recommend to chase things like that. There's games, stop stuff, and Bitcoin. Of course, we don't recommend that. But um, you know, that's that's what happens. You get this speculation, and people confusing speculation and investing and gambling. So also, we look at what's happening to interest rates. We go to a ten-year bonds as Australian ten-year bonds. Well, it's taken off. So when people say, "What's going to happen with interest rates?" Well, the bond market's telling us interest rates are going up at some stage. That's the ten-year price. It suddenly jumped up quite quickly. Look at the global price, 10 year treasuries, which is the US, well, back up it goes. So if you've got a mortgage and you're about to lock it in, probably do it now. Again, we're not going to predict the future, things can change, but the market's telling us the interest rates are going up. Reserve Bank said they're not going up for three or four years. The market's telling us they're going up sooner than that. So again, we've got to keep an eye on these things. What does it do for your portfolios? It doesn't mean we suddenly change things overnight, but it, again, it sticks to our philosophy of remaining balanced, not chasing two or three stocks not trying to chase the market, remaining disciplined through the, through the process. Um, it's, it's really important. And we'll always stick to those fundamentals. So if you've got any questions about that, um, please call. That's what we're here to do. Um, love to talk about this sort of stuff, of course, all the time. It's what we do day in, day out. Um, also, this week we ran a, a webinar, a retirement webinar. Um, for those who attended, um, the tech did crash a bit on us. We had some digging out on the road, which I think killed our... Uh, our internet for that hour, which was made it interesting. But the point was, what we often do with this um, uh, tools here is we help people understand how much money they'll need in retirement, how long their money will last, and we use some simulated graphs to do that. Um, and we find it really helpful, and I hope that clients always find that helpful as well. The feedback is always great. So if that's something you'd like us to go through with you or haven't been through with you for a while, please let us know, because this is a really useful tool um, to help map out um, retirement incomes. Last bit of a long video today, uh, our book launch, we're doing another book launch uh, on the 1st of April, so save the date, and I've got Senator Andrew Bragg, so he's a federal senator, it's really exciting, Andrew Bragg's going to host the book launch, it's going to be in the city, uh, we did a little book launch in um, December, just before the lockdown, um, so to have a senator, a federal senator, want to launch this, um, it's really exciting for us, and um, we look forward to sharing that news with you. So have a great weekend, lots to talk about at the moment, um, and please, please call if you've got any questions.